Police have extended their search of a pond and a woodland in Wiltshire, where they've uncovered clothes belonging to the murdered Swindon woman, Sean O'Callaghan. Specialist teams have already found more than 60 items of women's clothing and a shotgun, and they're investigating potential links to Sean's murderer, Christopher Halliwell. Harriet Hadfield reports. Deeply secluded in an isolated woodland, this small pond is now the centre of a major police investigation. Specialist search officers drafted in by Wiltshire police from across the region have combed every inch of the wooded area and uncovered a portfolio of shocking evidence. Divers first found this lady's boot at the bottom of the pond over a week ago. The next day the pair was completed and officers confirmed they belonged to Sean O'Callaghan who was stabbed to death three years ago. Meaning the discovery of this single barreled shotgun broadened the investigation immediately. Part of the police investigation has involved draining the water completely to allow specialist police officers, including the dive team, to carry out what's described as a fingertip search of the silt that lines the bottom of the pond. Police have cordoned off the area around the scene. It's rural countryside surrounded by fields. It is popular, though, with dog walkers. Among them is Joe, who comes here on a regular basis absolutely horrified you don't expect something like that on your doorstep do you we're in the middle of nowhere but i've got my two dogs so they look after me um and until this happened you know you don't hear of anything around here um i've always felt really safe and i still do feel safe it does feel a bit creepy um but there we go life, life goes on perhaps one of the most alarming discoveries was made a hundred meters from the pond Police described a pile of material found buried under a layer of mud. It contained 60 separate items, some believed to be women's clothing. Police say it didn't belong to Sean O'Callaghan. The 22-year-old was abducted and brutally murdered in March of 2011. She was last seen on CCTV leaving a nightclub in Swindon. Her body was found in Oxfordshire. This man, taxi driver Christopher Halliwell, pleaded guilty to her murder and is serving a life sentence in prison. But there's another case connected to Halliwell that Wiltshire police say is a priority in the search. The murder of Becky Godden Edwards, still unsolved, even though Halliwell led detectives to the discovery of her body. A botched police investigation meant he never faced trial. Police have extended their search period until the end of this week. And with the amount of potential evidence discovered, now there's the chilling prospect that further forensic work could reveal answers to other unsolved cases. Harriet Hadfield, Sky News, Ramsbury in Wiltshire.